Let's divide the decimal 0 0.5 by the decimal 0 0.1. So 0 0.5 divided by 0 0.1. And we could think of it like this. We could think of it as 0 0.5 over 0 0.1. That's probably a little bit easier way to think about this. So now if we move this decimal point over one here and here, you see it's just five divided by one. And we know that five divided by one is five. So that's one way we can figure this out. We end up with five. Another way we can do it, and we'll get the same answer, is like this. We take the 0 0.5, let's move that here, then we'll divide 0 0.5 by 0 0.1, like that. So again, we're gonna move those decimal points over. We'll move this one over here and here, and now we're just seeing how many times one goes into five. So we can get rid of these zeros here and the decimal points, move this over, and five times one, that equals five, subtract, no remainder. So again, 0 0.5 divided by 0 0.1, we end up with an answer that is five. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.